So let's go back in here. Oops, oops, oops. I don't want to be there yet. All right. So the first thing you want to do is I'm going to open a new file and we're going to start up. I don't know what this is. New project. New project. Here we go. So we're going to call this Tale of Maros. And I believe I actually have already a thing called Tale of Morrow's demo. And this is going to be a demo. So this is, I'm going to actually, uh, when we hit a point where I can actually post this, I'm going to post this little uh, demo up online and see what people actually think. And you guys can play it too if you want. So yes, I wish to overwrite it. Yeah, that's fine. So if we go back here just to check, everything should be everything should be empty. No, it's not. Shit. Okay. Let me fix that really quickly so that we can start from scratch. Uh demo delete. Yes. Try again. Cancel. God damn it. Alright, let's call it something else. Uh, no, let's not call it something else. I really want to delete it. Because I don't want to rename it later. Yes, please. Thank you. Okay, cool. All right, now we can start. Take two. Should have really made sure that was not a problem before I started. But anyway, Tale of Maro's demo. Obviously, if you this is based off of my... Um, D&D campaign, so if you haven't seen that for now, you're fine. There won't be any spoilers for that, because all it is, it's going to be basically system. So, Alright, demo. Oh my god, really? Yes, override it on the cloud. Now here. Why is it... It's still doing it. Like, it's resurrecting the folder. Okay, I'm just going to call it something else and then um, yeah we'll do it later all right so now it's completely from scratch okay so the first thing we have to do is make our um, to-do list and um, the first thing is pretty easy is make the game widescreen so let me actually uncheck this because I put X's and to mark off what I already have done six save i don't know why it's called that but regardless um all right so actually what we want to do from start basically start off new map uh map this is going to be intro and this is where the um character character uh, creation will take place because you can't actually you, you basically have to do everything on the map. What you will do is actually fade out the map and then fade in the pictures that you want to show. That's the way I do it. Maybe that's gimmicky. And if you guys have a better way for, for me to do it, if some pro is watching this for some weird reason, uh, you can definitely tell me. But I, I sort of like this way. And uh, the character creation is going to get a bit messy, as you will see in the event thing. But I think we are going to be fine. So as I said... Uh, let's actually launch this. Yes. It probably won't work because I don't have a starting position. Yeah. So, um, starting position player. Let's do that just for now. Yes. So, as you can see from now, this is what we see. It's kind of ugly box. Uh, we're going to make this widescreen. And if we start the game, it will actually be just blackness, darkness. Okay. So, first thing, let's make it widescreen. To do that, pretty easy. Um, you go in here, and all of these are basically the scripts for making the stuff work in the default RPG Maker. And which you, where you put your uh, modded stuff is in here. So I'm going to start um, with naming this um, shit. So I inserted this. Uh, I'm going to start like categorizing stuff so that because there's going to be a lot of scripts as you guys will see so we're going to start um, core 
system, let's just name it that. And in here, we're going to create a new one called resolution change. And let's go back in here and double check that I'm doing this right. Resolution change, graphic resize, this is the thing you want. So that you just pull, copy, oh well, just type this out graphics.resize underscore screen 640 360, and that will pixelize it or change the resolution. And you can't actually set this to higher than 640, and I believe 4 something. I just made it uh, 69 so that it kind of resembles my screen. You can make this number bigger, but this is a set at maximum. Okay, so apply. Let's check that it works. Yes, always save. You don't want to lose. All that work, okay, so we got the